today's word of the day comes from the book of 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 18. 2 Timothy chapter 4, verse 18. And it says, and the Lord will deliver me from every evil work and preserve me for his heavenly kingdom. To him be glory forever and ever. Amen. Praise the Lord. And the Lord will deliver me from every evil work and preserve me for his heavenly kingdom. To him be glory forever and ever. Amen. Praise the Lord. Every evil work comes from works of darkness, spiritual forces on this earth. Uh, that are not of God or for God. It's not really people. We know that. We've heard this many times. And all the plans of the enemy and every single work that's been placed against us will always, gonna, will, we're going to be delivered from all of it. And that's what the Apostle Paul realized and and preached. And that is a word for each and every one of us. It's not a new word. In Isaiah 54, verse 17, it says, No weapon formed against you shall prosper, and every tongue which rises against you in judgment you shall condemn. This is the heritage of the servants of the Lord, and their righteousness is from me, says the Lord. In Genesis 50, chapter, uh, verse 20, we see jo jo Joseph, his brothers tried to kill him, sold him as a slave, did all those things, but he tells his brothers in the end, but as for you, you meant evil against me, but God meant it for good in order to bring about as it is this day to save many people alive. All the things that happened to him and all the things that happened to us, God turned it into something good for the salvation of many souls. We can hang on this word. It's about the Bible, many examples. So, Lord, we thank you that you will deliver us from every evil work and preserve us for your heavenly kingdom. To you be glory forever and ever. We thank you for this word. Give us the, the help us believe it, put it in our hearts, and help us rest in that. In the name of Jesus Christ, amen. Praise the Lord. And that is our word of the day. Praise the Lord.